<laughs> You'll have to come to the other talks. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry. Okay. Yeah, Nassim, it was a very interesting uh, discussion. I think uh, you've, 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 you've cracked the unified theory of things, basically. <laughs> could, could you say that? Well, I think I'm getting definitely close. I think I'm pointing to a direction where, you know, our universe is not uh, just, uh, you know, made up of um, allegories with, and, and, uh, and concept that cannot be visualized, but actually have some fun fundamental mechanics that yeah. don't, not only describe the physical world, but actually you know, a lot, what a lot of people think of as the spiritual world. Yeah, and uh, you, you, you're, the people who've come before you have tried to to basically put it down, the people like uh, what uh, Nikola Tesla and uh, mm -hmm. Einstein, his last sort of work before he died, he was working on this sort of unified field. Yeah. Now, how did you sort of, did you have some magical epiphany to, or how, was it a, a long process of discovery and, and research to... Many to, epiphanies. Yeah. Many moments that of really amazing, you know, discovery and, and uh, it, moments of illumination where it just came to me and, and the pieces fell together and it was just, uh, it just, it was just a beautiful process. And you described before that, uh, the, well firstly, what, what's the, the, that, the, that po the, the, the minutest point that, that we can understand and measure, what's that uh, part called? I forget what it's called, uh, the point. The Sig singularity? Ah, oh, I forget oh. the, 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 the proton? <laughs> the, the, no, the, uh, the, the co there was a, it was a number, the, someone's number. Oh, well, anyway. The vacuum? <laughs> I've lost the word. But uh, you, you've sort of, you, you've, you've, I like the, the way you broke it down, that you, you can't reduce things to the smallest contained part. It, everything always gets smaller. And right, you can always yeah. divide to smaller and smaller pieces, like the, yeah. the dot can be divided and divided and divided so like um, I think that we have to come to conclude that you know it we will never get to a fundamental particle but we will always yeah. have further divisions and what's the whole point of the CERN uh, God particle is it they, they want to find the smallest particle really is that what, 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 what's well, your the view CERN, of that? the CERN um, experiment is really to uh, they're looking for this particle, um, they call the Higgs particle or the Higgs boson mm -hmm. and it's a part of the Higgs mechanism and it's a whole, you know, uh, mathematical allegory that is attempting to define the source of mass. Right. And I think that once again, you know, we're missing the point, mm. um, you know, literally. Yeah. Uh, and that is that uh, the vacuum is the source of mass. And that's what I want to talk about as well. Uh, the old concept of ether, would, would you call, I mean, use the word space and as is the, is the, the, the mass that, I mean, the, the energy that, come, that any, everything comes from. Is that ether in your uh, understanding? Yeah, you could call it, it, it was called many, many things throughout the ages. Like, you know, in more modern terms, it was called ether. Yeah. Um, in um, in uh, ancient times, it might have been called, you know, prana or chi, even? chi or you know, um, and then in quantum theory right now, it's called vacuum yeah. energy or vacuum fluctuation. Or, right. And um, you know, I think it's all the same. Right. Yeah. And it um, it's extremely energetic. And it's a field that connects all things. Right. And a certain percentage of that field, a very small percentage of that field, yeah. produces the material world we experience. Yeah, and yeah. it's just, uh, there are a lot of researchers who are cracking that, the connection and getting energy from the vacuum. And uh, it's, it's very, uh, the, the fact that you've put it into, into mathematical and, and physical concepts that, we, that people can go out there and understand, it's great. I think, uh, thanks very much. Your your speak, speech was amazing, and we we really enjoyed it. Thanks very Thank much. Thank you. Nice Appreciate. Well.